First of all, remember when working on your papers in Word that DMAC printers only print double-sided. Your instructors are aware of this and will be fine with you submitting your papers in that format. Do not attempt to change the setting in Word. It may or may not work for you, but it will mess up the printer and the printing process for students for the rest of the day. Microsoft Word has the ability to help you create your in-text references, your references list, and track all of the references as you write. However, while the Word Citation Manager can help provide some guidelines for your citations, it does not follow APA standards perfectly and typically make several mistakes in your citations. Make sure to double check each citation alongside the Urban Library Citation Guide handout or the APA Style Manual. To set your paper up to do this, go to the References tab. From there, under Style, Ensure that it says APA 6th edition. When you are writing your paper and are ready to add a source, select Insert Citation. Make sure that you are still in the References tab. Then select Add New Source. Look at the type of source and make sure that you have the correct type of source listed there. In this case, we are citing a book. Also select Show All Bibliography Fields. Fill out as much information as you can and select OK. This will insert the in-text reference wherever your cursor was. The citation will be formatted correctly in APA style. However, you will need to add your page numbers. To do this, click on the citation, click on the arrow, and select Edit Citation. Add the page numbers for the information that you are referencing, for example, page 36. Press OK. Now your in-text reference is correctly formatted according to APA style. For information on creating your references list in Word, go to Part 2 of this video.